Hello, everyone. There's already a fair number of people who are out on social media saying how did they announce these plans in the past. Well, this is different than what they've said in the poll in the past. have said for some time that they will open a plant in China. And the reason is simple. China is the number one market for electric vehicles. And while Tesla has been increasing sales, look at the real the level of increase here. It has not been a huge surge in sales. And we've been over to China. We've sent to the Tesla Galleria. And some of the charging stations there, about 14% of its sales last year were in China. The plans for building a gigafactory in China are significant from this standpoint. It would be both a place for battery manufacturing as well as for final assembly of vehicles. And most believe that it's the Model 3, which is the mass market model, that they're just starting to build here in the United States and delivered here in the U.S., as well as the Model Y, which will be a small crossover utility vehicle expected in the next two to three years as the world races towards a greener future. Mega packs are one of the cheapest ways to add new power to the grid. For example, it's much cheaper to build a solar farm than a coal plant, a natural gas plant, or even a nuclear plant at this point. The focus is on Tesla's never-ending search for new ideas. Join us as we break down this monumental project and talk about how it will change the world of energy. With the opening of their giant pack factory in China, Tesla is set to change the way energy is stored on a global scale. Join us as we go into the specifics of this historic project and look at how Tesla's new ideas are changing the future of energy. Get ready for an exciting ride, but first, if you haven't already, click the like and subscribe boxes. Don't forget the message welcome to Tesla.news bell and let's get this movie going. Experts say that Tesla's energy division could become a market powerhouse. By the end of the year, they expect revenue and margins to have doubled and they expect exponential growth to continue in the years to come. But in order to get there, important steps had to be taken such as starting construction on the MEAP pack factory in China. There is exciting news. There are finally signs of building at the site. New equipment has been seen on the site recently, which suggests that progress is being made. Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla, has said that he wants to make storage as important to his business as making electric cars. This is a growing field, with the International Energy Agency predicting that storage capacity will rise from 19.3 GW in late 2012 to almost 150 GW by 2026. The plant will be Tesla's second in China, after the electric vehicle factory that was built in 2019. At the signing ceremony, visual evidence from careful observers like Wu shows promising signs of progress. Here are some experts' thoughts on all of this. Well, Energy is indeed a thrilling frontier. It's pivotal for bolstering our grid reliability, an aspect that's often overlooked with the rising demand for electricity, especially from power-intensive sectors like AI. We're at a critical juncture. If we want to avoid economic pitfalls and foster growth, we must embrace technological advances. MEAP packs show promise as a cheap way to increase grid capacity, especially when compared to traditional energy sources like natural gas or coal. The ability to collect solar energy and store it for uninterrupted supply is very useful, especially for projects that need constant power, like AI data centers. As we move forward, electrification, including electric cars, is definitely necessary. But the lion, some of our energy needs in the future will come from new industries like AI, so we need to put money into expanding our power grid to meet these changing needs. Emerging markets like China and India, as well as the United States, are facing huge energy demands. NEAP packs are a key part of meeting these needs. Setting up a MEAP pack plan in China is a strategic move by Tesla to meet the needs of these growing markets. Due to the high demand, especially in China, it's possible that the Shanghai Jita factory will not be able to meet the needs of India or any other country. In the long run, Elon Musk has said that the energy business could be more profitable than the core auto business. The Mega Pack factory is the next step in Tesla's energy venture following the success of large-scale battery installations that have been steadily growing in profitability. The quick startup and success of Jiva Shanghai showed that the Shanghai Megapack factory could also make a big difference in Tesla's bottom line more quickly. Energy is still an important factor, especially since the power needs of supercomputers are growing. 
Reports say that tech giants like Microsoft are having trouble getting power for their huge computer groups, which shows how urgently we need strong energy solutions. The talk about energy needs to be eye-opening, and Tesla's mega-pack factories could become key players in meeting this demand, which could even outpace the need for traditional power sources. There are new details about the problems tech giants like Microsoft are having. Reports say that Microsoft engineers are having a hard time getting power for their huge computer clusters. This is based on what Kyle Corbett learned from talking to a Microsoft engineer who worked on the GP6 training cluster project. Attempts to put the cluster in one state were thwarted by the sheer power needs. It's shocking to learn that having more than 100,000 H100S NVIDIA chips in one state could overload the power grid. This shows how important it is to have strong energy solutions. This revelation puts light on the huge problems the tech industry is having meeting rising energy needs, making it clear that innovations like Tesla's MEAP pack factories are needed right away. Now that building has started in Shanghai, people are looking forward to swift growth. It's expected that work will be finished in nine months, which will be a big deal. On the ground, views of milestones show encouraging signs of activity. Big cranes are already at the site, which suggests that swifter growth by placing the factory close to the supply chain. Shanghai's strong battery supply chain gives it a clear edge over the U.S., where Tesla used to have to import materials from large-scale battery installations. Although there have been some small delays, Tesla wants to speed up production in the hopes of making more money in the long run. This is reason to celebrate and a sign of good things to come for Tesla's future plans. A top official at Tesla, Roman Patel, recently talked about how India needs more advanced battery storage systems to help it reach its lofty energy goals. When you think about how telecommunications infrastructure has changed over time, it's clear that advances in technology have made options easier to get and cheaper. For example, the prices of solar panels and wind turbines have gone down and microgrids have been created. In the next few decades, energy systems around the world will change in a big way. As a country with a large and intelligent population, India is becoming known as a hub of innovation and progress. However, the country struggles with inadequate infrastructure that slows its progress compared to more developed nations. However, the arrival of cutting-edge technologies presents a chance for India to skip over traditional barriers at a fraction of the cost incurred by developed nations. This potential transformation holds promising prospects not only for India, but for the global economy as a whole, enabling more participation and economic empowerment among the Indians on the world stage, similar to how we developing countries skipped over outdated technologies in the telecommunications sector. With the urgent need for data centers and strong power infrastructure, India is ready to embrace the next wave of technological progress, Demand for megapack factories is set to skyrocket. Tesla's strategic move to build such factories, like the successful launch of Luri, shows a pattern of exceeding initial expectations. There is growing talk that India might build more factories before it builds more auto plants. This is because energy storage is so important for power in data centers and making technological progress possible. As countries get ready to meet the energy needs of growing data centers, Megapack factories become essential assets. In addition, Tesla's work on hydrogen fuel cell technology adds a new layer to the energy scene and could lead to long-term energy storage and grid stability solutions.